I'm sorry if you can hear my cat just like walking around in the background. Really, he's just gonna make a ton of noise and I cannot be asked to stop him. So if you hear stuff like scrapping around and stuff like that, I can't do shit about it. He ain't gonna listen. Anyways, hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. If you're unaware of who I am, I am Ren and welcome back. It seems I am a TikTok drama channel now. Uh, what can I say? I am drawn to brain rot like no other. However, in my search for my brain rot content, I keep coming across straight up content that's like from the hub. And you know what hub I am talking about. A hub with a certain jingle that I'm sure most men would recognize as it goes a little something like this. Yeah, that hub. It's an ongoing problem that I made a video about before my channel was like actually getting views. So I'm doing it again, baby. Back to TikTok and its love for the devil's tango though. It's like no matter what you search on TikTok, it'll either be straight up bedroom wrestling or the strangest video that you have ever like laid your eyes upon or just straight up like people who aren't all together, if you know what I mean. like. Injuries that are fatal, I guess, is more so how I could describe it. Because, I mean, I've seen some feral shit while using the TikTok search function. It's either the bedroom ritual, racism, or really, really out there insane fetish content. Like feeders or feet. TikTok is littered with actual NSFW and, well... Crunchy, calm down, dude. And well, gotcha life, NSFW. Now we've seen inappropriate content on apps that are commonly populated by children. That's always been a thing just cause it's easy to prey on a kid's curiosity and make some weird shit that you know will get views. I mean, look at gotcha life. TikTok is littered with actual NSFW and well, as mentioned previously, gotcha NSFW. And NSFW trends that just get by, like the filters, and I do not know how. I literally have had the misfortune of scrolling past a few really NSFW trends while on my editing account. I am asexual, so I don't know why I, I, like TikTok thought I would like to see that. I didn't want to see that, uh, but I didn't open the app like a week after I was traumatized, so you know. This isn't really an NSFW problem so much as it is like a moderation problem or like a content filter problem. Uh, there will literally be NSFW videos at the top of like certain locations that you click on and people will be like, hey, click the location, you'll see something cool. And then it's just like a woman throwing ass, if you know what I mean. I've learned swiftly not to check out the really cool video under locations people are telling me to check out. Um, I've learned my lesson really fast. Unfortunately, I am naive, so I immediately fell for it the first time it happened. Cause I'ma spoil it for y'all. It ain't cool. It's just someone clapping cheeks or audios of women during the happiest moments of their lives, if you understand what I'm getting at. Like, not a wedding, not having a baby. I'm talking about some other happy moments in her life. <laughs> I cannot show these trends, but I can describe them. Uh, the first trend that traumatized me was a trend where it looked like it was just a pretty woman posting herself. And I fuck with that. I, I like to look at pretty girls, so I mean, I, I see the vision only for a video of this woman riding something that is not a horse to be overlaid on top of it with a transparency down. So like it would be just one video overlaid on top of another. Too crunchy? Can you calm down? Thank you. Now, I do often like videos of women sitting still and looking pretty, so maybe I just like set myself up for this to happen. However, I can say confidently I did not expect for it to be that. The next trend I had the misfortune of seeing was one where it looked innocent at first, but the more you looked, the worse it was. This trend was just like a woman showing off her nails, only for it to pan over to show their other hand. Gripping their man's schmeat, like holding their man's joystick to show how large it was under the guise of showing off her new set of nails. I genuinely don't know how this got on my For You page as I don't even look at content revolving around nails or men's schmeat, but apparently TikTok found it necessary that I saw that. While it's not that big a deal since I am a fully grown woman, and in all honesty, if it were just side boob or male abs, I would be all f Can you stop? I got my friend. 
It's my friend. While it's not that big of a deal since I'm a fully grown woman and in all honesty if it were just side boob or like men's abs I wouldn't be here complaining but it's straight up like NSFW content and like plugging the outlet or shmeet in my face and I don't want to see that. The moderation on TikTok is just so god awful. I got my comment removed for bullying for saying the lights are on but nobody's home in response to someone being a dumbass. But if you post corn, that's fine. Like you chill. That's okay. I can get a video removed for existing in a swimsuit, but nudity will literally stay up for days. I literally searched Maine Coon, you know, like the cat, and what showed up was covered in fur, but not exactly what I was looking for. <laughs> what do you want? I've learned just to not use the TikTok search feature at this point because I have also seen straight up live leak content from using that feature. If you don't know what live leak is, you probably don't want to find out, so I won't suggest you go and look. I understand it's hard to catch sometimes and AI filter systems can miss and it can miss some things. However, when it's at the top of the search engine, no matter what I search, that's not a needle in the haystack. That's like that just happened to get through it's an actual fucking problem <laughs> okay i'm sorry for laughing at you okay <laughs> You just flash the camera crunchy. Even worse, it's being shown to kids. I have a pretty clean for you page. I literally watch cat videos and like parrot videos and gaming content. In fact, my YouTube homepage is very similar to what I would watch on TikTok, but you know, longer form content, obviously. And I don't see YouTube showing me women getting their cheeks clapped. If my very clean algorithm is showing me this content, I can only imagine children are seeing it too. The primary demographic for TikTok is users under the age of 18. I made a video three months ago talking about how bad it's gotten only to be proven wrong because it's just gotten much worse. The You ain't even peeing, you're just playing the litter box, dude. He's gonna do this for like five minutes. I made a video three months ago talking about how bad it's gotten only to be proven wrong because it's gotten worse somehow. Like the issue is still ongoing like three months after I made that fucking video. At least in the original video I made it was only accounts in the rare search term bringing up NSFW content but now it's literally every fucking time I search something someone's shaking ass or doing the devil's tango. Like this is a problem that needs to be fixed prime because there's kids being shown literal corn like straight up you don't even got to go to the hub you can just search something up on tiktok and it'll be someone getting their cheeks clapped like actual corn too not like anime or fiction it's like actual irl people doing the deed like just straight up i'd really just like to like search part two for my reddit videos tiktok i don't want to see that shit also speaking of reddit videos there's just straight up smut being written and then posted under the guise of it being a reddit video on tiktok and it's always really weird smut like father daughter or something like that or teacher student where it's like a female teacher male student and that's so fucking weird because tiktok is populated by kids it's just like i don't think that should be on anyone's for you page i don't think that should be on anyone's algorithm period unless they're a fucking freak and searching for it because i'm talking i've heard some reddit stories where it's just straight up describing the act and you know it's just smut it's literally just smut and it just still shows up on like for you pages or in the search bar when you search something and i don't know why i don't know how that gets past any content moderation of uh, filters or whatever because it's literally just straight up like illegal material being written out and posted under the guise of it being a reddit video i've gotten videos like that no i don't care that you want to do the deed with your father it's so weird stop anyways I believe that I've yammered on long enough about this. 
Um, if you would like to support me and my channel, you can like and subscribe. Or if you would like to contribute to my cat's catnip addiction, you can become a channel member by hitting the join button next to the subscribe button. Or you can join my Patreon. Channel members and patrons get early access to my videos and a special role in my Discord server. So if, you, if you're interested in that, you can, you can do that. Uh, it really helps me out a lot. Anyways, I'm Ren. I'm tired. And thank you for watching.